part of gastroenterology is, is similar to internal medicine and then part of it is similar to surgery. So we have some patients that we see chronically, whether it's with inflammatory bowel disease or other chronic illnesses, not like internal medicine, but then there are a few patients we meet only on a procedural basis like a surgeon. Colon cancer is one of the most common cancers in the world, unfortunately a cause of significant mortality. We think it can be prevented with early screening, and so that will be part of my role here. Uh, I will also be bringing a new technology to Williamson Medical Center, which is called endoscopic ultrasound. So the endoscopic ultrasound, uh, I tell patients it's like an ultrasound probe. Uh, someone may have had um, an echocardiogram, may have uh, an ultrasound of a baby. So the same concept, except the ultrasound probe is actually on the tip of the endoscope. So when passed into the mouth, it looks in the esophagus and stomach at you through the area and around it. I have known Dr. Lindsay now for about 15 years. She and I were fellows in the training program at Vanderbilt together. And as I was exploring changes, I uh, contacted her and, and we began a conversation and then felt led to, to come to Williamson Medical Group. So I love the arts. The one thing that I do now uh, in the arts is actually play the trumpet or a cornet, which is the British style version of a trumpet in a brass band. My wife and I love cooking. And uh, one of my favorite foods to make and uh, favorite things to do is actually I cure and cook my own bacon. Home smoked pork belly, sliced into pieces and bacon, and uh, it leads to happy families and happy neighbors.